Hey guys, what is going on? My name is NoJ456, and today I'm showing you guys how to do the updated Flytrap Easter Egg in Black Ops 3, the giant map, and also how to get the Golden Gun Pistol, the Annihilator Pistol for your character, and to kind of have it as a tertiary extra third gun or fourth gun if you have Mule Kick, and just be able to tear up some zombies whenever you need to, and you can just whip this thing out and do some major damage. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how to do this thing. It's very, very easy to do, and let's go ahead and jump into the tutorial here. So the first thing you're gonna do is pack a punch any gun that shoots bullets and make your way over to this area of the stage and aim and take fire at the panel and see what happens right here. Oh, I want to play a game. Let's play hide and seek. Those were her exact words. So as you can hear, whenever you activate that, Maxis will take the place of Samantha in announcing what is going on. And now there will be three teddy bear locations around the map that are different than last time. So let's go ahead and take a look on how to get each and every one of these. So the first one up can be found by power. It is sitting on the balcony above on one of the buildings and one of the scaffoldings. All you need to do is take aim, hit it with any weapon. It doesn't have to be an upgraded weapon or anything like that. Just take aim, hit it, and then you'll hear this quote from Maxis. Hey, you found one. I can hear her. Even now. So again, these can be done in any order, but all you need to do is make your way over to the first floor in one of the teleporter rooms, and you will go down, and you will see this dark little hole where a radio used to be. Now, all you need to do is shoot the monkey that is sitting in there, and you'll hear the second quote. Wow, you found another one. There must be a purpose to this. So the third and final location for the flytrap easter egg is in one of these giant cylinders. All you're going to need to do is just jump up until you see it, and then you're going to need to jump up and shoot it with a gun. Obviously, it's better to have some sort of SMG or AR, but you can do it with pretty much any gun. It just has to shoot bullets. Again, hit it, and you'll hear this quote. I see it. The beacon is lit. I know where and when you are. Sooner or later, I will find you. Together, we will ensure a better future for the children. So once you have done this, make your way over to the furnace in the right building, and what you will see in the furnace is the Annihilator Golden Gun Pistol. Now this one is a one-shot kill until around round 20, and then if you hit him in the legs, it's not going to one-shot kill. But it does work exactly like the sword does in Shadows of Evil. You can pull it out, you can use it as much as you want until it runs out of ammo, and then it will automatically go back away. Or you can pull it out, use a couple shots, put it back away, it does not matter. But once you put it back away, you cannot pull it back out again until you have full ammo. And the way you recharge this thing is by getting kills with it you cannot use a max ammo on this you can't get it any other way but getting kills and then you will be able to pull it back out once you get enough kills to kind of charge the pistol back up and be ready to use that super ability but that is it guys i hope you did enjoy this we found all three of these ourselves on stream earlier on today it was an awesome awesome experience and uh thanks to everyone who came out to the live stream i'll probably be live streaming again later on today with some more black ops 3 zombies so make sure you guys do leave a like and subscribe if you would like to see that check the description down below with a bunch of other tutorials on how to do everything you need to know in the giant and shadows of evil and i will see you all in the next video thank you so much for watching and adios my friends